Welcome back to Houston Life. You know, we're always on the hunt for the latest beauty trends that promise to help you reverse those pesky signs of aging like wrinkles and fine lines. And that's where our friends from the Anti-Age Institute Wellness Center and Medical Spa come in. They have been helping patients like Tessa and me yeah. look and feel their best for more than 25 years. Please welcome Dr. Richard Laconi, along with esthetician Natalie Knickerbar Knickerbocker, <laughs> nurse injector, a CT Yaya, registered nurse Megan Marco. We also have our lovely models, Tracy Thompson, Stacy Casciola. The house is full today. That's right. Uh, Dr. Laconi, <laughs> let's talk about this uh, platelet rich plasma that Natalie will be using on Stacy's face. How does this process Absolutely. work? And Natalie, go ahead and get started. All right. Get going. And so half of her face is already done, right? Yes. Okay, good. Look. Yeah, so we did one half just so people can see what it looks like afterwards. And you can see that it's really fairly tolerable. And uh, what it is, is a little machine that punctures tiny little holes in the skin, micro needling. And so the idea there is when we put on the platelet rich plasma, which has exosomes and growth factors, repair factors, uh, that those uh, micro needling provides little channels for those substances to get down into the skin where they can trigger growth, healing, and just generally rebuilding of the skin. Wow. So uh, it's basically a stem cell-like treatment. And what you're providing is, again, channels for the stem cell elements to get down in there and do their thing. We're hearing a little whirring. Is that the, is, that's the skin pen? Mm -hmm. That's right. Explain the skin pen for people who don't know. That's what's going in and making those tiny little holes. Yes. Um, so it's a sterile disposable cartridge and it has 14 teeny tiny little needles that are making that micro injury. Um, and we have different depths to choose from. So depending on what we're treating, how aggressive in what area, we adjust the depth. Okay. And, and you could be treating everything from uh, texture issues, fine lines, pore size, mm -hmm. scarring. And Natalie, before the segment, you actually took Stacy's blood, you spun it out yep. to extract that platelet-rich plasma or PRP, and that, Dr. Laconi, is now being injected back into Stacy's skin. Absolutely, yeah. The platelet-rich plasma is a component of the blood that everybody has, okay? Mm -hmm. And it's actually Liquid the component gold. of your blood that arrives at an injury first. So if you injure yourself, then the platelets immediately arrive there and start spewing out all their healing ingredients, okay? Uh, exosomes, growth factors, repair factors that make the skin kick into high gear to repair itself. And that's what this is. We just extract it from the blood with a centrifuge and uh, off it goes, you know? There it is, the centrifuge. We're seeing that right now. Yeah. And right. not only goes liquid gold, it's liquid it gold. It is liquid gold. <laughs> and this yeah. process is so interesting okay. because Stacy looks so relaxed right now. Stacy, I know you're having a treatment done to your face. Are you feeling anything right now? Are you feel, feeling any discomfort? Not at all. Wake up, Stacey. Not at all. I know she's asleep. She, you were disturbing no, her now. Sorry. <laughs> and then how quickly does the redness go away? I know that's a common question. Well, you know, you can almost tell, see how red it is here, but it's just barely pink over here. That's the one we did half an hour ago. So. Wow. Yeah, so the, the redness fades pretty quickly. Uh, you just got to take care of it. By tomorrow, it'll be 80% back to normal, and by the next day, you won't be able to see any sign of it but just okay then the healing starts that's incredible okay. natalie knickerbocker you're doing a great job on stacy's face there uh okay let's find out what ct and megan are doing tracy thompson thanks for coming into model today it's great to see you okay filler in the hands this is maybe a new concept for a lot of people dr laconi why would someone put filler in their hands well you know i hate to say it but you know for folks as they get a little older the veiny and tendinous hands are kind of uh, the you know i think a lot of people, only the neck is more, uh, you might say... Like ages the quickest, right? Yeah, right. right. And, and it's something that everybody dislikes. So We're seeing some before and after photos right. on our screen right exactly. now. Exactly. So this is an example where the after, you, those veins are not as pronounced. We're not seeing... Precisely, yeah. Exactly. Well, you know, the idea here is, is that, you know, you lose the sub-Q tissue in your hand due to sunlight exposure and aging and other factors. So without that sub-Q tissue to hide all that stuff, it's always been there. It's just as we get older, we lose that sub-Q fatty tissue that hides it. So we're just going to put this back in here to hide it again. Okay, so we're watching video of the needle go into the hand right now. Does this, I mean, she's perfectly still. Does this hurt at all? Very calm, Tracy. It really does feel like just a tiny pinprick. But once she gets that pit pinprick in there, you really feel nothing. Did they, they numb your hands? Cannula, yeah. They did. They numbed my hands. Okay. 
um, for several minutes before. But to Dr. Lacone's point, your hands are such a tell of your age. And it felt, I felt like I woke up one day and went, oh my God, I've got old lady hands. <laughs> and then suddenly when they did this on my left hand today, all of a sudden I see volume. Will yeah. you hold up your left hand yeah. so, so we can see it at home? So this hand was already treated. You have beautiful hands. Yeah, yeah what a gorgeous hand but model you, were self, you are. You were self-conscious about that. And this is I'm after scary. treatment. I'm surprised it doesn't look like red. Lumpy, bumpy, red. No, this was 10 minutes ago. Yeah. Okay, wow. that's incredible. The cannula is the key. That it's little cannula. The cannula it, well, the cannula doesn't have a, a sharp point on it. We make one little nick, nick, nick just to get through the skin. Then the cannula can go all the way up here. It, it doesn't have a point or a sharp edge on it. It's just blunt. It just rides right through the sub-Q tissues. It slides right through there. Um, we deliberately make an effort to avoid sensitive things like the veins. And, and uh, it's quite comfortable. And yeah. yeah. So we talked about the latest and greatest, but let's talk about Old Faithful. Botox. The Botox. <laughs> you guys are working on Tracy's neck right now with the Botox. Sorry, oh, I don't know if you can see that, Tessa. Oh my gosh. Okay, what's going on over there? <laughs> CT, what's going on? So we're doing what's called Microtox and um, she's bothered by these tech neck lines or horizontal lines. Hey, I'm getting those So you too. can see. Oh my gosh, yeah. I can't even, okay. And it's pretty painless, right? I mean, you're getting filler on your hands and then you're also getting Microtox to the neck. And so what that's gonna do is help to just tighten the the, the neck area, and that way those horizontal lines are not as visible. You know, it's it's so interesting because the neck area, like we were mentioning the hands or a telltale sign of aging, I feel Absolutely. like my neck, we're all kind of looking down at devices and then you have these rings around your neck. And just to be clear too, for anyone who's never done Botox before, it's not filling the creases, it's sort of relaxing that muscle so your own natural collagen can fill in. I feel like I could work at the anti <laughs> Institute. I need my Botox. They also do semaglutide, the list goes on, go see them. Thanks y'all, it's great yeah. to see ya. Great, Thank Okay, you. let's take a break. Here's my right back. Before we go, we still have the team from the Anti-Age Institute in the house. By the way, big news, Res registered nurse Megan and CT, they're both expecting, they're both pregnant. Congratulations. Inject Thanks me again now. to the whole team. <laughs> Sorry, can you just fill my... Rejuvenate me. Something. We'll see you all tomorrow.